I'm Lucy Edwards, Director of Client Success at VHT Studios and now Metaport, and I'm at Wicket Realtors in New Jersey. And my guest today is Bill Scavone. And uh, Bill is the president of Wicket Realtors as well as Wicket Realtors affiliates or franchise. Yes. It's great to be here, Bill. Thanks for being here. And Thanks for coming. Very nice to meet you. Uh, would like to talk to you today about First of all, your rich history. Wicket has been around for a long time. You and your affiliates are in 40 plus states. So let's talk about the history and how you started. Yeah, I'd love, love to tell you about that. Um, I, I always start every day saying, how lucky am I? And part of that is I woke up, I'm above ground. <laughs> Uh, the second part is I love my job because I get to go and tell this story about the rich history of Jim Weicker starting in 1969 uh, in Chatham, New Jersey, building out that office uh, with his wife and growing the business and how he grew the business methodically over time, adding on services after service after service with really a couple things in mind. One is people buy people before they buy a product or service. So it's always people first with our company. And um, this, the second thing was really, we can only grow our business if we have good people. And I think that's one of the key things, both in our company footprint, as well as in our franchise. We look for good quality people who want to engage into our tools and systems to help them grow their business. And I always tell the story of, uh, that Jim told me, how he got started. And he went to the train station in Chatham and he handed out business cards every single day, every morning and every afternoon. And as he handed out the business cards, he'd say, if you're thinking of buying or selling a home, please think of me, my name's Jim Weikert. And then lo and behold, he gets appointments. And um, the story goes on that he gets his first listing appointment. And he had no money to do anything to market the home. So he went around, put signs up all over Chatham, New Jersey to get people to go to an open house. We believe we invented open houses, uh, or Jim invented <laughs> the open house. And um, the story goes, he had a lot of people come uh, to, to the open house. And later in the, uh, the week, someone saw his mom walking through town and they said, wow, Jimmy's made it big. I see his signs everywhere. All he had was one listing, but he held it open and marketed it properly. And really the business took off from there and they methodically grew the business because he had a formula. And then that formula was repeated uh, uh, every single year of how to expand that business. And then now we're in 43 states. Mm -hmm. uh, we have nearly 500 offices, both company owned and franchised. And, um, but those true beliefs of people buy people before they buy a product or service still hold true today all across the country. People buy people. I so agree with you. And uh, real estate business is based on relationship business and relationship is between people. So right. that is so important. And he probably touched a lot of lives when he was just in person, uh, shaking hands, uh, talking about himself and inviting them uh, over. Uh, to the open house or yeah. to list the house with him. You know, one of, one of our ad campaigns years ago, and we still use it across the country, is invite us in, we'll bring results. Oh. And, and that's one of the greatest things is if we can get in and talk to people, which is, it's a people business. And, and I always like to say, you know, it, people say get nose to nose, belly to belly. You know, I like to say we get heart to heart because oh. we want to work with our clients, right? And it's all about the customer experience. So when we focus, and this started back in 1969 to today, it's all about the customer experience. Are we delivering our best for the customer to give the, the greatest level of service and the greatest experience they have? And if you do that, they're going to come back uh, twofold. You're going to get the referral business. You're going to continue to get their family's business down the line. I have a gentleman that lives on my street here in New Jersey who said he's bought and sold about four different homes all through Weikert. And Jim Weikert was his first salesperson. Oh, really? So he stays with the company because of the level of service that he got. You know, that is it's a just great tremendous. Testimonial. That, is, yeah. that is a fabulous testimonial. I love it. Yeah, yeah. it's fantastic. And you have, what, 6,000 uh, agents and uh, 7,000 with affiliates. So that is a great network. Yeah. Also, network, network for referral business and also for connecting uh, your clients mm -hmm. with someone else uh, in a different state. Yeah, when you look at our, our entire company, because Wiker's made up of over 16 different real estate related companies. But when you look at just our, our three that deal in the residential side of the business with the company owned offices, over 6,000 agents in the franchise world, we have over 7,000 agents. And then we have a referral company that has over 5,000. So when you're really looking at that, we're close to 20,000 licenses within the Wiker family of companies. And that doesn't even include obviously all of our all under one roof that we have about the customer experience. What that is our mortgage title and insurance. Um, so it's really, we look at having this process as taking the care of the customer from the day we meet them, however, which way we meet them, whether it's an open house or a phone call or a community event, we can take care of them all the way through to even their car insurance. So, I mean, <laughs> that's what we want to do. It's about the customer experience. 
Well, you just mentioned all under one roof. I would like to talk about it because it's uh, it's all about customer. It's all about making it easy, simple, and smooth. The smooth transaction. They're already stressed out, regardless whether they're buying or selling. They're already stressed. So you are making it very comfortable for them. Let's talk about that. Yeah, and you know, when you look in the industry today, everyone's looking for like one-stop shopping. Mm -hmm. You know, I can get it all in one place. Well, guess what? We pioneered that. When I say we, Jim Weicker did this, mm -hmm. you know, I think it was back in the 70s when you, it just made sense. If I'm working with you to buy the home, let me help you get it funded. Let me help you get the insurance for the home. Um, and it, it just makes a lot of sense because if you can take care of your customer from end to end, they won't go any, anywhere else. And I think that's just the whole thing. If you could control it, when you look at our corporate relocation company, same thing. So not only do we do the relocation and find, uh, market their home in one area, find them a home in another area, but we also uh, hook them up with the mortgage, the title, the insurance. We even have a moving company to help them move their household really? goods. We even can help them with their tax returns. So when you think about the holistic approach that we're taking, it's, it's all about that customer, the experience they get with us, because we know if you take care of the customer, they take care of you. Exactly. It, it's really a simple formula, but you got to do it. You got to execute. You know? Yeah, exactly. Um, and I would say that a great asset that Viking Realtors have is your leadership, your managers. They invest so much passion into every agent. And I, I've been to so many offices at Wikert from South Jersey to North Jersey to New York. And I can tell you that every single manager is like a friend to their to their agents. They can go with a brand new agent from the first contract to putting a business plan together for, for the next year. Right. You know, I, I love that piece of it. And, and part of it is, is everyone's experienced. And we have a great, Weikert's known for training. We have a great training pr platform. Um, and then we have a development platform to get people into management. And what's cool about that on the franchise side of the business, we take in, independent owners across the country bring them in and slide them into our system of mentoring and training and coaching a series of systems to grow the business. Mm -hmm. So when you really look at our, our management staff, I think we have the best in the industry and I travel the country and I talk to a lot of people and what I see ours, they're buttoned up. You know, they know their numbers. They know what, what makes it work because everyone had to have that experience and grow up in the business. Um, and typically within the Weikert family, they learn the tools and the systems that we have. So they're masters. Um, and we do hold our, our managers accountable in terms of learning our, our listing system and our listing presentation and practicing and role-playing it with each other. They practice recruiting phone calls, they practice onboarding. So when you're looking at that, when you, when you do these things um, consistently in the repetition, you become very good at it. Mm -hmm. And I think it's just the culture of our company to be really buttoned up, well-trained, and then you tie it back to the people by people before they buy a product or service. So it's, it's a people business. So when you take the expertise level and you tie in the interpersonal skills, you know, it's usually a home run, you know, so it's and, fun. And uh, speaking of uh, speaking of ed education, uh, you are humanizing everything now. You are getting together. Uh, I see you have uh, classes throughout the building uh, and, and some of them are large, some of them are small. Uh, so that is a, that is a really great opportunity for agents also to mingle, to learn from each other, to get back to real world and to be human again. Right. So I, I really appreciate that you are arranging that atmosphere. Yeah, you know, you gotta bring people together. Um, we're social animals, right? <laughs> and we wanna interact. And we we find it incredibly valuable to be, to be able to get um, face to face with folks. Um, you know, that's the business we're in. So even when COVID hit, we were still doing the open houses wherever we could and doing it in a safe way because we wanted to get with people. and. I think the more times you bring people together, you learn more from each other. Exactly. And, you know, the socialization factor of it, it's fun. Um, you want to have fun in what you're doing. So we try to put things together. And not only do we do it at our, our world headquarters, but we also do it in our local offices. Our managers are fantastic coaches. And they get the people into the office and, and get them engaged. Because the more engagement there is, the more activity there is, the more conversations there is, the more contracts you get. So <laughs> that's true. You know, it's a simple business, but you got to do it, and um, it, it's just so important to get together. And I'm so glad, you know, we're we're getting out of this uh, uh, pandemic the way we are. Mm -hmm. um, and you know, one thing we learned too is you can also help educate people virtually as well. But nothing beats getting together and being with each other, laughing, sharing, having a cup of coffee, telling the war stories. You, you really learn more from that.
Absolutely. And regardless how many agents you have in the company, 7,000, 20,000, the family atmosphere is here. Mm -hmm. And you even have the events that put agents together and you appreciate them again, every, the mingling and the, the presentations about some success stories. I think that's so important. Let's talk about that. Yeah, sure. Um, in fact, we just came off of what we call Founders Day. So we've been in the business now. Jim Weicker founded the company 53 years ago. So we just had a huge party here. We had it up in New York State. We had it down in um, uh, the Washington, D.C. area in our capital region. So we had a simultaneous party going on, um, a lot of celebration. People loved getting together. So it was really probably the first big, big, big event since the pandemic hit. Um, and it was fantastic. Over thousands of agents doing it. And, um, you know, the electricity and the energy is contagious. Mm -hmm. That's why you got to bring people together. Right. You know, there's a sense of community and pride of people who are coming wearing their yellow shirts. We had a yellow, um, I don't know what you call it, like a, a little uh, uh, pedal cart thing. Uh, uh -huh. What's that called? Do you know what it's called? No, you put like at the beach, you know, you go oh, up and yeah, down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So they're pedaling around in that, having like races, like a golf cart kind of thing that you pedal. And uh, we had food trucks. I mean, just the excitement going on. People are excited to see. Now, here's the other thing. When you're a big company like this, it's hard to keep that family feel. How do you do that? You know, we, we cross our regions and people meet the South Jersey folks took buses up here and, um, oh. you know, they visited Pennsylvania, took buses here in New Jersey and um, they got to meet each other and see what everyone's doing. And you see how your market's different when you share with each other, but you also see how closely related they are at the same time. Um, and people love to share that information and just be with each other. You are also in charge, besides being a president of Viket Realtors, you are the president of Viket Realtors Franchise Affiliates. Uh, can we talk about that? Just a few words, where you are, um, how you took it off the ground, and you've been in that position for quite some time. Yeah, over 18 years now uh, in that position. Um, it's, it's awesome. Uh, when I first started, I think we had maybe 60 or so franchise offices, mainly down the East Coast. Mm -hmm. You know, now we're all the way out to the West Coast, California, Arizona, Oregon, Washington State, like I said, 43 different states. And I, and I think the greatest thing there and, and what I'm most proud of with, with the franchise is we survey them every single year. And um, we get a report back, a scorecard, uh, based on how we're doing with our advertising and marketing, our training, our technology, our uh, coaching, our branding, and um, also our core values. And the highest score we get is on the core values. So on the scale of one to five, we get like a 4.65, uh -huh. the highest one. And the reason I'm proud of that is you can fix technology, you can fix marketing, you can fix training. It's hard to fix a relationship. So we're big on that relationship. And one of the things is, one of the big things in our core values is we do what we say we're gonna do. So if we say we're gonna do something, we get it done. So we really pride ourselves on that. And I think the fun part of this is the franchises get together every year as, as an ownership group, a manager's group. In fact, we're going, to New Orleans in a few weeks, uh, oh. bringing them all together for coaching and training, networking, fun. And um, when we get together, it's just the sense of pride to see that something that started with Jim handing out business cards uh -huh. at a train station right. has turned into something that's in 43 states with people so proud to wear the Weikert name in the color yellow. And it's, it's just awesome to see. Um, I enjoy it because you're working with business owners every single day and they take great pride in their business. Mm -hmm. And um, they enjoy that many of them came to us with not a lot of tools and systems. And all of a sudden they plug into what we have. You know, they plug into all of our training programs, they, our, our uh, networking sessions, all of our great marketing and advertising that we have. Uh, you know, it's so easy to use. They, they plug into our technology. But most of all, what they plug into is the Weikert way. There's a Weikert recipe on how to do business. Uh -huh. And they just love it because now they have a plan, you know, a true business plan to grow their business. So it's something they didn't have. But most of all, you know what they have? each other. If anyone asked that question about franchise, uh, and even our own company owned offices, is that we're in this together and they develop friendships in groups that they count on and they feel like they're not alone, you know, that they're together with somebody else in the fight. And so it's awesome. And they can ask for the advice and they can uh, connect and, and also probably network. What about uh, all under one roof? Uh, are they sharing that system as well? Uh, they don't share in the financial system uh, that we have due, due to different you know, uh, laws and things around oh, the country. That's true, yeah. But they share with everything that we have within the, the, the umbrella. So the corporate relocation, the White Group Direct, White Group University. So all those things are all under their roof. But financially, they all work with uh, different partners. And probably um, with local. The local providers, and, correct. Yeah, correct. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, that makes sense. Yeah. That was a silly question. That's okay. There's no <laughs> silly question. Um, 
But we do teach them mm -hmm. the model that Weikert has. So they do, they'll develop relationships just like here. We, ha we supply it to our company offices. We teach them the model that they should have in place in their offices. So they do have that aspect of it. Uh, marketing strategy is very important for every property, in my opinion. And Metaport or 3D tours, uh, a huge part of it. Can we talk about the importance of professional photography and, uh, and 3D tours and Metaport? Oh, absolutely. Uh, you, you hit the nail on the head on this one. Everyone's visual. So the better things look visually, the better things are going to sell or be marketed when you think about it. So professional tours, you got the drones now flying over. They're beautiful. Uh, they can take some beautiful shots. Matterport's been around. I think since it first founded, a lot of our franchise owners, as soon as they came out, picked it up because they were like, this is something different. It sets us apart um, and it provides the customer with a view that they want, you know, before, you know, as a realtor, you almost maybe, you, you, you want people to see what you have. You want to talk to them. So if you can give them something different and you stand out, you're, you're, you're raising your game. You know, so I think Matterport is a fantastic tool. Um, professional photography is almost a must nowadays. Everyone's visual. Everyone, everyone's going online first. They're looking at things on social media. So you better have things, you know, geared up for those, those uh, marketing uh, avenues. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, thank you. Community. Uh, Working with community is very important, and I understand that your agents are very passionate about giving back to the community. And you are participating in so many charity organizations. You also have events. You are raising funds. Uh, can we uh, talk about uh, charity organizations that you are part of? Sure, sure. I, I think you know one of the main ones is uh, the fight fight against cancer. Um, we, for over twenty years now, have been running a fundraiser outing. Uh, where a lot of our um, our associates, our managers, our biz, our outside partners that we do business with, show up. I'm, I think we filled three golf courses with people. Oh, nice. um, they stayed. We started at nine in the morning and it went till about ten at night, and I was there all the way to the end. Oh my goodness. And uh, I think this this August we raised over two hundred thousand dollars. That's probably one of the bigger ones. But then you look at the local community. We do so many things. When you think about it, when you have five hundred offices around the country. I can tell you any day I pick up my, my phone and get on Facebook, someone's doing something for somebody. We do uh, uh, some of the things, you know, back to school kits for the kids. Oh, that's nice. Um, um, the food bank. We just did a huge, um, with our corporate relocation company, Weikert Workforce Mobility, um, a walk for hunger. That's something we're big into. Um, so we did that across the country as well with all of our affiliates. So what we did here, we spread the word to everyone else to take part. So we have that. We do a lot for Toys for Tots and, and uh, toy collections. Um, I know a lot of things with the food bank. So there, there are just so many things we do because, you know, that's what we do. When you're a realtor, you're part of the community yes. and you're there to better the community and make it better. So, you know, the more involved you can be, you know, just the better for everyone. Thank you. Thank you so much, Bill. That was a great, great conversation. I really appreciate it. And I am much more knowledgeable now about Wicket Realtors, so I really appreciate it. And I just can't wait to spread the word about your fabulous company. Well, if you, if you stay another hour, I can fill you in on more things. <laughs> There's a lot to talk about. Oh, you don't know me. If you, if you, <laughs> if you let me talk, we'll have dinner together. <laughs> I'm free all weekend. <laughs> Thank you. Thank, Thank you, you very much. much.